Leah Salmon than actually he coach. And firstly, today, uh, yesterday, sorry, was the um, celebration of wholeness event in Lambeth Town Hall for Mother's Day. Um, it's where I launched my sixth book, Stress Free Monthly, and did a talk on how to naturally relieve menstrual problems. I'm I came back from the event buzzing out. It was a really, um, it was had, the event had a really great energy. The the guests were wonderful. The the general energy of the whole event was wonderful. The organisation of the event was good. Um, the store, the speakers were very informative. I learned a lot um, while I was, you know, taking in everybody's presentations. Um, and the response to the talk that I did was so amazing. Thank you for everyone that took the time to come and um, you know, share with me the, their feedback from the talk that I did, How to Naturally Relieve Menstrual Problems, based on the new book. Um, people that came over to the table, people that stopped me as I was walking, I really appreciate you taking the time to um, share your feedback with me. It was a really well received talk. I <laughs> managed to film the whole of my talk and then delete it as I was looking at it on the camera. <laughs> Um, straight afterwards, I was so gutted, ah, oh, but I know that the event was filmed so I'm going to try and go ahead and get the footage so that I can um, put it up on my channel, YouTube channel and share it with you guys who were, who were not able to come to the event. Now the Healing the Nation organize, organize, um, committee that's been founded to put that event on and subsequent events, you know, definitely well done to, to you guys for putting on such a dynamic and diverse event and there are going to be events happening all throughout the year till November. Um, I'll put up an image of the back of the fly so you can see the different dates. These are the ones in London, but I know that they do want to do them throughout other parts of the UK as well. So I look forward to supporting those events and letting you all know about those events too. Now, this video is an answer to a question that I got on Facebook from a lady who was asking what I feel the impact of a vegetarian diet is, or vegetarian lifestyle, is on menstruation. This is an excellent question. I don't know whether this is where her question's coming from, but I know that there is a, um, you know, there's a message that's given out among the vegetarian community, vegan community, raw food community, that taking on those diets and lifestyles can have a beneficial impact on your menstruation and that is true to a degree however if you like me are uh, like I was when I was a teenager if you are living a junk food lifestyle a junk food vegetarian lifestyle then your vegetarian lifestyle is going to have a negative impact on your menstruation if you are living as a whole food vegetarian where your focus is on eating whole natural unprocessed nutrient dense um, oftentimes water rich foods then you're gonna have then that type of a lifestyle and diet is gonna have a beneficial impact on your menstruation when I was a teenager I feel my vegetarian the way I was living as a vegetarian was what caused my menstruation um, problems which led me to start my whole career so I'm beneficial I'm you know I'm thankful for what I went through in that respect but in, you know if you are just focusing on I'm just gonna eat anything but as long as it doesn't have animal products in it you're gonna have a completely different experience I was living on cheese pasta rice um, soya large amounts of soya unfermented soya the GMO soya soya milk soya burgers soya bacon soya everything I was living on um, and I wasn't getting a lot of fruits or vegetables I was getting a lot of fruit juice I was still eating chocolate um, sweets chewing gums I loved so I was taking in all those chemicals from from those foods so my vegetarian lifestyle was no in no way shape or form conducive to me having a trouble free stress free monthly or a period or menstruation the other consideration is that even if you are eating a whole food, unprocessed vegetarian diet, it also will depend on what your body actually requires. The, the, 
the balance of nutrients that works best for your body and this is where personalized diet planning comes in and you listening to what your body needs as opposed to just I'm just going to eat a vegetarian lifestyle because if your vegetarian lifestyle is high in proteins and fats like the your purine rich vegetables and the co loads of coconut oil and loads of palm oil and avocados and nuts and those types of things but your body type is a body type that does better on higher levels of salads and fruits and vegetables and you know the, the lighter more carbohydrate rich foods then your vegetarian lifestyle is not going to benefit your body because it's not the balance of nutrients that works best for your body so you're not going to get beneficial results from the veg that type of a vegetarian diet and that leads to the mindset of the vegetarian diet doesn't work for me no the vegetarian diet that you were using isn't right for you if you change the way that you eat as a vegetarian and adopt a more you know a lighter more vegetables more fruits those types of things then that will be beneficial to you so there's a, there's two things that we kind of need to take into consideration one is your vegetarian lifestyle made of whole unprocessed foods and two is your vegetarian lifestyle made of composed of foods that work best for your body type so i hope that answers your question if you have any other questions on this subject or any other subject to do with natural health or whole foods please feel free to get in contact with me message me on facebook leave a comment underneath this video in fact leave a comment underneath this video if you have experienced um, difficulty with your period based on the type of diet that you're living if you are a raw foodist and you had a great period please post below if you were eating a heavy junk food diet and you didn't have such a great period post below if constant you know on the flip side if you were eating not so great of a diet but you still didn't have menstrual problems post that below that'd be interesting to hear from you um so post below your experiences with menstruation and um it's been Leah Sam the Naturally You Coach I hope you have a great day take care and stay healthy